hope you are doing great in this flutter tutorial uh, i'll be talking about how to create this kind of button menu options uh, actually it is called fab carousel button and this button is uh, you all know that it is a floating action button which which comes under scaffold and the same you can handle from here also so without any delay let's get started and if you are new here then please subscribe to my channel and like the video so yeah uh, let's start so for this you will have to install a package with the name this one fab circular menu fab circular menu so this is the package and i will paste it inside the de description box you can copy that from my description box and uh, yeah let's start so first of all you will have to create a fab key global key so that you can control your button movement from this key and then these are the basic things i have taken a scaffold and inside that there is a container and in this container i have given this color which is the color which is visible on this particular screen then i have taken center that is why these two things are in center and then i have taken column inside column it is clip or rect and this is image widget so particular this animation is a gif image and it is a image actually and with a border radius of 125 because the height height width of this image is 250 and after that there is a space and this is my material button so this is the button so on pressing if fab key current state is open then it is close and if it is open then it will it is basically it is doing vice versa thing if it is close it will open and if it is open then it will close so these are the thing inside this condition and this fab key is this key that i have created in the beginning so this is the key of that fab button you can say and after that inside scaffold this is my container this is floating action button inside this there is a builder and it is basically a returning fab circular menu so this is coming from the package that i have installed and this is the key that i have created here so this is the key it will recognize this uh, movement with the help of this key so you can change the alignment of this from here and right now it is bottom right and if i will do it bottom center then it will also work like this it is it is also looking good like menu button you can add several options also there so it will act as a menu button so for now i have let me revert this so bottom right is looking better for me so these are the options and these are the properties of fab circular menu you can handle it ring color like if you will change here like white to purple control s after saving this the color is changed so you can handle this from here i want this color for my project ring diameter ring width fab size you can also manage here fab elevation so these are basically the properties you can use in your project and this is the color of uh, the button which is changing like when it is open it is in red color and when it will be closed it is in green color so these things are handled from here fab open icon fab close icon so this is the icon so you can also handle it suppose it is white now i am going to make it black let's see what happens yes now it is black when i will press it will white so you can handle this from here 
animation is also there let's see bounce out let's see what happens yes you can also manage animations from here and you can also handle the duration you can change the time of opening and closing of this button with the help of this so again after that it contains children this fab circular menu contains children because there are more than one options available so it comes inside this so i have taken here raw material button and this is my first button the icon is home icon so this is the home icon and on press i'm navigating to home screen so let's press this this is my home screen so it is navigating you can add according to your use you can increase the number of buttons here inside this children and this widget so there are actually five buttons so let me shrink it then you will be able to see it so these are the five buttons that is inside it i will put the whole code uh, on my git and will share the will share the link of the git in the description box you can use my code in your project and uh, just uh, uh, request you to please subscribe my channel because it gives motivation uh, for me to make new videos and yep yeah, that's it for now hope to see you next time in our next video bye for now